a crop, the false harvest may be consumed at the household level. But this can catch also the local market or the export market. And nowadays, we have seen within the sub-region or even within the local market, we have areas we can explore for our farmers to gain the sweat they encounter in producing those crops. If you grow vegetables, you can sell them at the local market, but you can also sell the quality ones with the hotel industry. This can earn you a lot of income. You can also export some of the vegetables to even Europe. We have encouraged growers to do this with little quality control. They can export their vegetables to the neighboring countries and even to the European or American markets. This is very important because it will earn the farmers foreign skin and the government also will earn foreign skin in this area. Mangoes we have seen is a very palatable fruit and most of the people in the Gambia are used to mangoes. And during the mango season, it helps to alleviate food shortage. Most of the time, during the harvesting season of mangoes, our rations at the household level is reduced. If you have a very good fruit of uh, mango, like the jatakundas and the bajikundas, they may not need lunch on that day. <laughs> and this is a kind of saving. Mm -hmm. And they are very important for our diet also. So we can also sell the mangoes at our local market for immediate consumption, but also for transformation. Now it is agriculture is encouraging people to transform some of these local produce into different types of juices, which are very uh, environmentally friendly and also they are consumer friendly because they can be kept for some time and uh, they can be used when there is some shortage. The pests and diseases, they are important because if they cause damage to these crops, we have quality problem for the market and we also have reduction in yield. If you come to some of our ornamentals, we have seen the white flies largely on the ornamentals. You will see the pictures. They are, you know, sucking the sap of these ornamentals and they are drying them. And these, of course, the flower lovers, is very important to them. It's like uh, <laughs> cash income to them because uh, we should not underrate how much flower can do to a flower lover. And uh, it beautifies her environment or his environment and also the environment of the country at large. We have seen the, a lot of ornamental work being done and the Department of Agriculture has a whole program in this mm -hmm. and we encourage people to grow ornamentals. So here are some few ideas we want to share with the public about how much this can help in maintaining our food security or on the other hand, how much would, would threaten the food security. Because if the pest population is very high, you go to some of the vegetable schemes, if the population of the pests are very high, they can cause total crop failure, or they can cause minimum 20 to 30 percent. Mm -hmm. Here is a woman who has been struggling to grow the vegetables for nearly two or three months, mm -hmm. and the pests come and uh, devastate them. This is of concern to the our culture. Mm -hmm. And look at the fruit growers. Mm -hmm. You are growing your trees for so many years, mm -hmm. and the harvest, you cannot uh, enjoy a harvest because of pests and diseases. So it's a very important uh, program for us, mm -hmm. and we think it has a lot of uh, threat to food security if we don't help each other, if we don't sensitize the public, mm -hmm. and we don't manage them well. Oh, well, thank you. Sir Pujame, can you, let me come back to you, can you tell uh, the Jola viewers what Landing has said in English? Landing <laughs> Kuno mene no mene ko tiengere di mo fam mubutem 
do nga rew nga rub kori ba ju ko bere e mo fam yo bare nem o katale e mo kajena mo ma mo noken di ko mangura mo le mo len gombul mangura kanu la ota wala ta furi ya de resinde de kanu no mena ndi marsay de surtout kanu no mena de no famu buter parce que dunia ta yo mi ne bu kanako ka fanor di kuyeti ko fele nak e ko ko fele nak mo mo riam ma jakam ko no men di marsay ka fanor e de karate ko fele nak mo mo riam ma jakam o no men di marsay ti dunia aw ba yiti ja mo riam ma mo riam ali mo jakut ja marsay ti dunia le te nom andu le to ba foreign exchange yo yo be e ko kajena ma kajene nya si flores ko tori sa ko jeewu jobe baabe ko tori sa e silu passa jakas ko mangom di bana banu manjum ko karen karen di si flores yo ne si wote la solo la si flores lebo e ba si si flawa si lebo e le jak be kaju ke kati kom ko tori sa ko la fon la ko la fon la kati mbaabe le jak be kaju ke paske wa fa wanu di kere wa 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 ba jum to jaw e ba green rambene rambe ko ci lek ana o mang ko ci lek ko le ko ko ju yo yo kanja e baba ji na fa mun mo kamme koro tandi ka kajena ka kajena kati mo nya mo lola e wala burom no warena wi to a mono uti kena do no manja ma fu ti kena meno kam mo ja ka kajena di ko bay tan ko tere yo sai nsida a nya fay mane ya isafo mbadi mane ko ni ko min ko yemi nyenen ka ak mayata pake eh minomu nyen ti nyar fo lok mayati na damoro ke na damoro fal ala sil eh damoro la karola eh niya jibe na damoro gunda ba kata yiri fengol yiri fen dinol la aneng gadin kamino do ku gadino yo nyunu ketti nyaro min ke niya jibe en ka dondolo mi ngadondolo min na folo folo nyen dondolo ala muso wala ke yiridumo taya bun ay kilo la akono ni wo kada do roy saje ko yiridumo nyen ka tolle ay jolon dum ni wo kada di ba jela la ko na jolonta yiridumo nyen na quality ake tala bakele dum ala soto nyum fanan ke nasile eh ni wo kata ya jibe folo 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 komanto ke duto mi export from the gambia wo seta kuma bakala atalata sidla tan tan lulu ma fama la ni akima eh fente fema wo sabe fo nyen dondolol min ko duto ma wala wo ko nasin de bakke ni nata nyem meto la karola anen sirimo la karola ni sirimo lu ila tinyaro be nyadile nyen flawa la karola flawalu e ka susule e ka susule yiri o ke ida nyene minna ke mona fang fengol minna ka banko nyen kono e nyen sir monen fengo ka wala meto nyen ka wala susu e fi fengo nyen bala na kata wo nyaama e saje ko fi fengo la domoro ani meto la ka tala ani sir ngol fi fengo tin ida nyina no a nyaama e ase yiri jambo nyen jande ase jolong e saje ko yiri ngo min be sotola je adi ngol te warala ya jela soto sen nasi ndum fana ibe fengo min soto la je asetala because ni ajibe nyen jamma fongala min nu ya lonko e ke flawal do ko e ka wafi ila soto bunda babe wo ma fongala so ningen tumboli keta fente mi ya lonko e ke e la tiñaro sembo warta bake e bo la soto nyen nasi ndela so akuma ya nyum fi tiñar fen sabo be ku ma tale bake na soto la karola bunto sa kontuma na domor fengo la karola as some of the recommendation the surveillance come up with in order to deal with the with the pests in terms of prevention sensitization uh, the kind of pest, pesticides they should use and um, stakeholder the involvement of stakeholders because, because i believe the department of agriculture cannot do it alone thank you very much madam i think uh, those are very important areas to discuss or to inform the viewers well when you look at the survey we have done a preliminary survey. Like I said, the Greater Bangul area and part of West Coast region. Mm -hmm. 